Hi, my name is Brian Hayes, and I'm the Global Product Manager for Magnetic Flow Meters with Emerson. The four basic configuration parameters for a magnetic flow meter are calibration number, sensor size, flow units, and analog output range. We will be discussing each of these in this video today. Start by identifying the basic configuration section on the local operator interface. This can be found in the lower left corner of the 8712 and 8782 transmitters. To configure the flow units, press the flow units button. Next, press the up and or down arrows to scroll through the options for flow units. And press the E button or the gray left arrow to select your flow units. Then press it again to save your selection. Finally, press the home slash flow rate button to go back to the home screen. To configure the sensor size, press the sensor size button. Then press the up arrow to increase the sensor size and press the down arrow to decrease the sensor size. Next, press the gray left arrow or E button to select the sensor line size. Then, press it again to save your selection. Finally, press the home slash flow rate button to go back to the home screen. Now, we will be reviewing how to configure the analog output range. First, press the range button. Use the right arrow to move the cursor to the place value that needs to be changed and use the up and down arrows to either increase or decrease that value. Once the primary variable upper range value or PVURV is entered, press the gray left arrow or E button to select the value. Then press it again to save your selection. Finally, press the home slash flow rate button to go back to the home screen. Next, we will input the calibration number. Your sensor calibration number is found on your sensor nameplate. To enter the calibration number, press the sensor cal number button. Use the right arrow to move the cursor to the place value that needs to be changed. And use the up and down arrows to increase or decrease that value. When the calibration number is entered properly, Press the gray left arrow or E button to select the value. Press it again to save your selection. Finally, press the home slash flow rate button to go back to the home screen. This completes the four basic configuration parameters for a magnetic flow meter. Please reach out to your local Emerson representative with further questions.